Okay, now. Okay. Um, concerning the situation in the Middle East, um, Seven years ago, after the death of Christ um, on the Christian calendar, okay, but Buddhist calendar 2,500 years ago, or 2,550, and. The patriarch of the Christian, uh, Muslim, and Hebrew was Abraham, all three. He came from between Iraq and Iran, here, okay? and. Everybody from here have dark skin, dark hair, dark complexion, dark eyes. Northern Europeans, blue eyes, blonde hair, light skin. Um, so Abraham Christ did not have blue eyes, blonde hair, light skin. Christ, same as uh, here, through here, uh, India, Thailand, um, Africa, Mexico, Central America, South America, okay? Up here, Sweden, Denmark, Norway, um, have light skin, 
blue eyes, blonde hair, huh? Vikings. Okay. So Abraham, uh, according to the Hebrews and according to the Muslims, came from between Iraq and Iran. So he had dark hair, brown eyes, and dark skin. He had two sons, Isaac and Jacob. The lineage of the Christians is from Isaac, I think, and the two brothers, the other one, the Arab lineage. So, cousins. And according to the history, Abraham migrated to uh, Egypt. Here. Uh, they're in captivity, the Hebrews, and work on make the pyramids and go to the later, like Moses, uh, promised land, and that is Israel. Uh, but there's already someone living in Israel. And according to the legend, they take the land, and then 2,000 years of problems. Um, the Muslims, in the holy site, the Dome of the Rock, where Mohammed leapt to heaven. And Christians, the birthplace of Jesus Christ, their Messiah, but not the Messiah of the Hebrews. They're still waiting for their Messiah. And now we have problems. Uh, the Old Testament of the all three faiths says not to charge usury or interest. And the only time, like I went to a Christian school. Uh, Muslims go to madrasas. Uh, uh, the only time in the Bible, because I go to a private school and have one hour religion, that Jesus was angry, mad, when he goes to the temple and the money changers and he tips over the tables and he hits the people with a whip. I can think of no other time. Uh, all three faiths fight over this holy land. It's nine miles across. It's 18 kilometers across. One little country, yeah? If we look up face in the almanac, are five million Hebrews living here, and one million Arabs living in Israel. The are 14 million Arab uh, Hebrews living in the whole world. Huh? For every Hebrew is 1,000 Muslims. I don't think any religion in the name of their belief should take someone else